Okay, first thing we want to do, make sure we open up Nefmoto on our computer. Then, we're going to take the cable, we're going to plug it into the laptop. We're also going to plug it into the OBD port. Make sure it's secured. Then, turn the key to the on position. Okay, now we open up Nefmoto. You come over here to the flashings tab. You click on it. You go to choose flash file. Open the bin file, which is the tune. And we're going to come up here and change the baud rate to 57600 and hit connect slow initialize. And we're gonna, it's going to start uh, connecting to the ECU. Once it says connected, come up here and we hit full right flash. It'll give you some warnings, make sure your battery voltage is good, which we're right below 12, but I know that my battery is good. Uh, it's advised to put a charger on it while you're flashing, but sometimes that's not available. So just go ahead and click OK. Make sure that it starts flashing. You'll start seeing the percentage going. And then uh, it takes about three to five minutes to flash. And we'll come back once the flash is complete. One thing to make sure is do not turn the key off while it's flashing and do not unhook the cable from the OBD port. If you do, um, the ECU has a possibility of being bricked. You can always go back in and try to reconnect and reflash as long as you don't turn the key off. If you turn the key off during the flash, that resets the ECU and it will be bricked. And uh, the only way to fix that is with a boot mode flash. So just something to keep in mind. Okay, the flash is almost complete. Looks like it succeeded. So, whenever the flash is done, you want to make sure you see 19 of 19 sectors successfully flashed. If uh, you do not see that and you get an error, then you know something went wrong. Uh, try to reconnect and reflash. Make sure you do not turn the key off. So, now we're going to hit OK. And at the bottom, we want to make sure that it says disconnected. And come over here, we turn the key off. Wait about 20 seconds. What that does is it resets the ECU. So after we waited, turn the key back on. We want to make sure we see a EPC light and check engine light, which we do. That's good. And you wait about 20 seconds. What that does is it resets the uh, throttle body and uh, the ECU wakes back up. And you turn the key back off and the key on and start it up. That's how you successfully flash with Nefmoto. Thank you for watching. Make sure to uh, subscribe to the German Elite Tuning YouTube channel, and uh, see you guys next video.